two high-tech cowboys from the Golan Heights took home first place in the best international startup category at the Giantex exhibition in Dubai last week. Beefree Agro's advanced technology uses artificial intelligence, computer vision and in-depth knowledge of animal behaviour and management in order to operate drones autonomously for the purpose of grazing cattle herds accurately, easily, quickly and cost-effectively. Founder and CEO Noam Ezran joins me now. Noam, thank you for joining us and congratulations on your win. Now, explain to us in more detail what you actually won this award for. Tell us about Joe. So, um, seeing as my partner and I, we both come from a ranching background. We've been working with animals uh, for many, many years and many years together. And about six years ago, we started developing or adopting a new tool for ourselves, which was the drone. Um, and as time went by, we realized that it can do a lot more than just monitoring, giving us better uh, perspective from the air on what's going on on ranches. Uh, and it can actually move the animals. And we've developed this technique for ourselves over many years. And when we realized how, how big the effect it had on our lives as ranchers, uh, we understood that it's something that we need to bring out for the whole community and industry to share. Um, and then we also realized that, you know, cowboys are cowboys and that they're not going to become professional drone pilots. And it's something that takes a very long time uh, to control and manage well. So we decided to create this autonomous system that basically helps them do their job in a much more efficient way. And how does this change the livestock industry then? So one of the major issues that are facing this industry is the really global shortage in skilled workers. Uh, being a cowboy used to be a thing that's a, that's a lifelong prof profession. It was passed down, you know, in communities from between generations. And nowadays, whoever comes to work in these industries is usually there for a very short time. And so the, the ranchers themselves are, are left with a constant rotation of uh, unskilled manpower and Joe our system basically takes this whole part of the job of doing the the monotonous and day-to-day -day and routine checks of the herd and moving the herd and checking on inf infrastructures and basically does it all for the rancher so what was the real selling point at Jitex that made you stand out amongst the other entrants um, so I think, first of all, we were one of, we were one of the only ag tech um, uh, um, startups presenting there. Um, and we're doing something that's very unique. Um, I think in many ways, there are many tools uh, that, are do, um, that are dealing with data collection. Uh, and what we're actually doing is an action tool. It's an action drone that performs jobs or performs a job that real people do, and until, up until this point was considered something that only people can do. Um, and I think our, you know, our Western outfits there, and the fact that we tried to do something for the local market with camels, uh, also drew some attention. Um, and being able to participate in the Supernova Challenge there gave us a lot of really good exposure. Now, it was an international award and you are expanding into an international market. Where else are you uh, looking at expanding? So the livestock industry is something that's, it's a global industry. Um, so our obvious markets, our initial obvious markets are the US and of course Australia. Um, and beyond that, we're also looking at, um, at South America, Central America. Um, basically, um, because of the coverage we've received in the last uh, month or so, we've been getting um, mails and calls from farmers and ranchers all over the world, from uh, Eastern Europe to Africa. Um, and we've, we're, we're, we're quite overwhelmed and excited to get all this feedback. So we're really out there doing our best to come up with the product as quickly as we can and give, this, give these farmers the tools that they need in order to, to modernize their operations.